ICML highlights, that's uh, such a difficult question. It's, if, if all you treat is lymphoma CLL, this really is the meeting. There are so many things going on. Um, I was struck by a lot of talks on metabolic imaging, new ways of actually approaching this from total tumor burdens to metabolic heterogeneity. Does that trump end of treatment pet negativity? Is it additive? Should we use that to stratify patients? Um, great data in Hodgkin's and primary mediastinal. Um, certainly very interesting. And then uh, the Hodgkin's data, fantastic uh, data from the German Hodgkin study group showing this remarkable uh, outcomes. Of course, escalated Birkop, which is their chemotherapy uh, regimen of choice, comes with its toxicities. So it's good to see the Rathal data and some of the, well, UK and global data there showing that de-escalation, removing bleomycin in those PET negative patients doesn't appear to compromise their outcomes. So that was really good. But of course, beyond Hodgkin's, there's really stimulating stuff in the CAR T-cell field, particularly uh, relapsed high-grade lymphomas. That's such a difficult area for us in the clinic. And remarkable data, 50% of patients getting complete remissions, which appear durable. And I was struck, David Maloney in his session said they've now treated 170 patients in Seattle. And it just made me think we are far behind in Europe. Um, so that's something that really is going to have to take off. And uh, of course, challenging technology, toxicity is very real, um, but it's, it's really great listening to an enthusiast and you, you walk out of the room thinking, wow, this is the future. So those are big things for me.